Hello and welcome to another daily dose of Jace tutorial. So for this video we're going to learn about transitions in Movavi 360 video editor. So here are a few clips that I've uh, put together. So the transitioning, uh, you can add individual transitions or you could do um, transitions for all, um, all the clips. So I'm going to start off with the individual first. So you just got to go to this transition um, icon or symbol right here, which is right on top of the letter T for font. The T is for the titles or font and the one on top of it, which is what I just clicked, it is the transitions. So all you got to do is pick the type of transition you want. You just got to drag it in between. That's all you got to do. Pretty simple. Uh, let me show you guys right there. Uh, let's see if I can uh, expand it so you guys can see better. Actually, you could actually just click right in between and then you can see right there. You can check the transition properties. Usually I go with fade to black. So there's a duration right here to increase the length of the transition. So it's pretty simple. Uh, let's see if I can... Uh, there it is. That's a, so that it's clear, you can see the transition symbol right there in between. By increasing the duration, I made it more visible. So I hope that really helps you guys see what uh, I'm trying to um, explain. So it's uh, pretty easy. So if I wanted to add um, transitions to this this side uh, in between these two clips where the orange marker is I just drag and drop it see so I could also click in between boom and you can see the transition right there so I could also do this yeah I click that transition symbol right there and then you can see like you can just do transitions for all of them which should make it a lot easier I actually highly recommend using just you know the all transitions button right there and then just pick a transition for all of them and then you can increase the duration you can adjust it and then click OK and then there you can see transitions in all on all the end of each clip you could change the properties as well I hope you guys can see that and then you can just put a check on it. Set duration for all transitions. I should have actually let off with that. Would have probably been easier to show you guys. Oh, there it is. So it's actually called a transition wizard. My bad. So it's called a transition wizard, and there's a lot of options. Uh, like I said, uh, Movavi is really, really simple to use. It's simple and efficient. Um, I did notice though that um, it cannot edit um, .mov 360 files because I was trying to do a um, edit a time lapse from GoPro 360. So when I tried to import it, um, just a heads up, it, the .mov 360 video files do not work on the on uh, this software. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. Take it easy.